You may need to adjust the decline bench. I like to move the seat up just one notch so it hits you comfortably in the back of the knee. And of course, you want to move the ankle pad according to what your leg length is. It should just hit you right at the ankles and then decline the back of your bench so that you're in a decline position. When you're all set, it should hit you just like this. What we're going to do is hold a weight near our chest, right underneath our chin. It could be a plate, it could be a dumbbell, but I want you to keep it there. Unlike the image down in the bottom left, you can see that I'm holding it over my stomach. That's going to give you a little bit of momentum. So by holding it near your chest, underneath your chin, you're going to make the upper body heavier, which is going to make this more challenging, and you're really going to use those abs. As this gets harder, you're going to feel naturally that you want to pull that weight away from your chest to make this a little bit easier and give you more momentum, but I want you to keep that plate or dumbbell touching your chest throughout all the reps.